Hi, my name is Darius. Welcome to my channel. Today, I'm testing Samsung Galaxy Note 20 Ultra. Is this going to be a great device for vlogging? I'll be checking uh, camera performance, taking some pictures, videos, time lapse, etc. Let me know. Okay, so this is a front-facing camera. It shoots 4K, 60 frames per second at the moment, which is pretty impressive. Uh, and I cannot wait to test this device here on my channel. I had S21 Ultra a few days ago and I was really impressed. Uh, and I'm wondering if this Note 20 Ultra is going to be as good or better. Let's find out. Right, so this is the uh, director's view, dual mode video. Really good for stories, etc. Also, you can switch the lenses. Oh, not, not the lenses, you can switch the view actually, uh, like this. Awesome, that's really nice. Okay, let's check and see how this zoom performs when making video. So this is ultra wide angle times one times five what do you think about quality all the lenses are capable of shooting 4k let's see if we can get even further oh yes all the way up to 20 Okay, but this is a digital zoom, so you cannot expect amazing quality, but it's pretty impressive uh, to get that far from this. Wow. Okay, so this is ultra wide angle and stabilization. Look at the colors, sharpness, really nice. The colors are very, very natural. Okay, so this is the main sensor. Again, 4K, 30 frames per second in this case. This is stabilization. Uh, this phone has optical image stabilization but if you want to go ultra steady mode, it's only 1080p. Times five. Let's walk, but it's got to be... Yeah, there's not really point walking without a big zoom. But it's actually pretty impressive that you can shoot 4K uh, on such a big lens. Brilliant. Let's take some pictures and see what's the quality like. By the way, if you are enjoying this video, smash that like if you haven't already. Cheers. Right, so this is the uh, director's view, dual mode video. Really good for stories, etc. Also, you can switch the lenses. Oh, not, not the lenses, you can switch the view actually, uh, like this. 
awesome that's really nice right so this is another uh, useful feature uh, portrait mode to make those videos uh, cinematic uh, with a nice blurry background so this is on the front facing camera and you can also do this on the main camera look at the colors absolutely outstanding wow so far so good let's take some selfies and see what's the quality like right let's check stabilization on selfie camera this is 4k 60 frames per second and i wish all the phones have 4k especially the premium ones i was testing a xiaomi me 10 sorry me 11 t pro and it's only 1080p which is a bit of shame i mean this is the beast so far i have to say this is my favorite device and i think it's even better than s21 ultra because you can get it cheaper and the build quality is just outstanding and it's not as heavy as 21 ultra 2 so for my small hands it does the job Samsung uh, 20 Ultra has a very very nice feature for taking pictures and making videos Check this out. I've put my phone on the tripod And now I'm gonna get the pen And by pressing this button I'm going to uh, release the shutter on the phone And this option actually also works on taking a video so now i just press that and now record it and now i'm going to stop right now Right now I'm going to check ultra steady mode. It's only 1080p, but let's see how stable it is when we do proper running. What well, is also pretty awesome that you can switch which way you want your microphone to be uh, facing as a front, as a rear, as it from all over the place. Really, really useful for vlogging. I love that thumb up okay so now i am using the front microphone to get the uh, sound let's move to the uh, rear can you tell me if it's any different and now i'm going to switch to the one that goes all the way around which is now you tell me if you feel any difference in the sound quality Please remember, I don't do any external microphone or do any extra color, uh, color grading on my footage. So all you can hear and see is actually coming from this device. Hope you enjoyed this episode and I'll catch you in the next one. Really like this device, by the way. Cheers.